everyone welcome back to my channel <sighs> so today I woke up and finally was able to speak um, and to express myself and to share after the unfortunate events that have happened over the past week um, I was really at a loss for words over the past few days and um, really operating at a low level vibration. I woke up and decided that I did not want to stay there. I could not remain there because that low level of energy wouldn't allow me to be productive and to move through my life um, in an effective way. And I decided that I was going to take that control back of my life and my reality while I am able to. For a lot of us, I know we woke up, we saw another hashtag and immediately felt an overwhelming amount of sadness. The sadness turns into anger and the anger turns into complete rage. And um, when you're in that state of mind, you cannot function properly. So I want to encourage you, if any of you have felt that way, are still feeling that way, um, way I want to encourage you to just transfer that energy of anger into awareness. Allow yourself to be aware of what is going on. Allow yourself to be aware of the reality of just what things are. Educate yourself and then prepare yourself and continue to live your life according to um, what you feel is right. So that may be paying closer attention to where you're spending your money, um, where you're spending your time, who you're giving your energy to, uh, and things like that. So I just want to share a few things that can help you easily raise your vibration because we need to be vibrating higher in order to be effective in our effort. So uh, first thing first, cut out the junk food cut out the junk food eat real food eat plant-based whole healthy food cut out the fast food get your body and mind clear um, drink tons of water really clear out the junk i know if you're anything like me all i wanted to do over the past few days was just eat crap because i knew it would make me feel good but it's not going to benefit us in any way cut out the crap food eat well take care of your body next thing would be to meditate and sit in silence as well as doing deep breathing this will help you to control your thoughts to take the time to analyze them as they come to you individually and decide what is necessary and what isn't um put your thoughts in order write them down uh, get them out of your head and onto paper I feel like the anger or the rage that is felt is enough to um, it's enough to spark the idea that something needs to seriously change. However, staying in that anger and rage is not going to allow you to put the effort forward to make that change. Um, so really meditate, take time for yourself. Um, and take those deep cleansing breaths. Next thing, get off of social media. Get off of Facebook. I find Facebook is probably the most toxic. Get off of Instagram. Get off of Twitter. Stop watching the news. All of these things are going to continue to showcase negative things. The reality is what's going on is very negative. However, Seeing the same videos over and over and over again is not going to make it any better. It makes it worse um, in your mind. For getting into arguments with ignorant people, with people that do not understand, with people that refuse to open their eyes um, to the injustice in this country, getting into those arguments is not going to benefit you. It's only going to make you more upset, so just get off. Just cut it out, get off. Another thing is going to be to get out in nature. The weather is nice. Go to a beach, get in the water, walk in the sand, go to a park, take your shoes off, walk in the grass. Just 
connect with the earth, connect with nature. Allow that to calm you and raise your vibration. Another thing that I found myself doing, um, probably out of habit, is just cleaning, decluttering, clearing space, making space. I feel like a cluttered space equals a cluttered mind. Clean your space, clear your mind, um, release all those crazy thoughts that have been going through your head, whether it be anger, sadness, fear, hopelessness, helplessness, um, any of those thoughts, allow them to just be released. Uh, that's why I say remain aware, but don't live in that fear, don't walk in that anger. It's not going to serve you in any way whatsoever. While you're cleaning or decluttering, play some music. Music that uh, makes you happy. Music that you feel is healing to you. Not the kind of music you listen to when you're ready to fight someone, um, because this is just going to feel your anger. So happy music, music that makes you want to dance and sing um, and just feel better. And the last thing would be to pray. And I don't care who you pray to or what you pray to, pray. As bad as things are, as bad as things may continue to get, uh, you have the power to control your thoughts and what is coming into your mind and what you're allowing to act upon. I hope this was helpful to someone. I know a lot of us could use it right now and I try to share myself on the internet in the most positive way possible and while I, you know, could have ranted and um, showed how angry I was that wouldn't benefit anyone so i decided to just raise my vibrations a little bit and share some of that with you guys um so as i always say and i will continue to say live light love heavy and be well please i will talk to you guys in the next video thank you so much for watching bye